Welcome back. Uh, we're gonna try this again. You have a breather? Feel better? <laughs> do it. We'll see. I forgot the sky rolls. Mm -hmm. Ah! <laughs> I didn't think you'd go that far. I was really hoping he wouldn't go that far. I'm still curious as to what this does. I'm guessing this is a bomb. My guess. Seems dumb. Because they don't do anything. They, no, just, they no, don't no, even explode, really. they just kind of float. There you go, beat rock mode. Just all floaty boaty. What? Get hit with the bus saw. Yeah, but didn't that happen last time? Uh -oh. I would have expected, like, uh -oh. dynamite to go everywhere for uh -oh. a bomb one. Yeah, or something. I kind of want you to suck it up and see what it is. Yeah, maybe a little bit. Uh, although... Jeez. It's been so hard to freaking predict. The bomb is on now. Well, I may have to do this again. Knowing my skills. Yep, you have to use this power. Can you, like, suck it up with the power? But yeah, if you use the power gun against power, like if you got the buzz saw and the um, and the bomb one, would it work against both of them? Uh, probably. Like you got your ninja stars. Mm-hmm. <clears throat> you could just have to wait till it's the star one. You know what I mean? Yep. Yikes! Not a big fan of that one. Yikes! Still really hard to dodge. This one's pretty easy, you just get greedy. Dang. Close. Well, better than getting hit. Oh, yeah. Whoa! I just about ate laser. Laser face! God dang it. Come on, one more hit. Yeah, you don't have to deal with that one again. Your other favorite one. Yeah, there's gonna be a lot of ice, I think, because he hasn't done this one yet. I think we're pretty sure we have to hit him three times with each power. It seems like it. It's gonna be close, man. Mm-hmm. Alright, so he's got ice left. Oh, and he hasn't done fire at all yet. But he did the easy one. That's uh Actually it's a little different. Yeah, up and down. Icy. Icy. Don't get hit. I'm trying very hard not to. <laughs> Watch out! Okay. Not just fire, right? Yeah. No, there's two more. Fire and bomb. Did you do the bombs yet? Uh, I think so. I think I saw two eyes. Ah. Yeah, there's two eyes, I think. Oh, maybe it is just fire. Yeah. Cause it's not like he has that many... Don't get hit. Yep. It's not like he has that many powers. Alright, next form. Oh, I thought there was two forms of him. There might be. But that might be the special ending. We'll see. I got the big shard. Oh, the fairies are restored. The sun is shining. Ripple Star is healed. Darkness fades to black. <laughs> Woohoo! You didn't catch me. Never mind. <laughs> oh yeah. Now I remember. Alright. I remember like... I remember the bad ending now. Yep. Looks like we're heading home. Oh, so cute. Seriously, that, that little fairy's adorable. <laughs> <laughs> Did you see DDD's eyes? Looks like he has the hiccups. Going home! Her, her arms look like... Yep. Her, her, her arms look like pelican wings. <laughs> they were like all flat. She's like, wap a wap a wap Whoa! I didn't know there was... Concept art? Yeah. Yeah, it's been so long since we played this. <clears throat> this looks, looks like a napkin drawing. <laughs> Some of this, anyways. Look at those exciting doodles. 
you want to skip and go back and try and get some more things while we still have uh, filling in this episode? Yeah. Yeah, no, I, I really do want to get the uh, the perfect ending. That would be my ideal. Or, do you want to do that and then, like, tag the perfect ending on the end of this episode? I think I think we'll try to tag the perfect ending on the end of this one. I think that's what we'll do, because this one ends up pretty short, right? Yeah, we're about six minutes. Okay. Then, yeah, I'll try to try to get the rest of the crystal shards... And, and tag uh, the perfect ending onto this. And yeah, it'll be it'll be coming soon. Uh, not to me, but to viewers like you. I got all the shards. Hold on. The the um mouthful. <laughs> <laughs> I may have done a montage. We'll see. You're telling me about that. I I did sounds, record it, but now uh, you can see this thing was blinking. That's because I have all the shards now. Sounds fun. Yeah, we'll we'll see what happens. You were telling me about it while well, I had oh, a crap. mouthful of peanuts, which is really hard to chew fast. Okay, got one hit in. It's good enough. I'm gonna have to do this fight again. As you guys have already seen. You didn't. Talk about my words. Ah, ah, oh, <laughs> after a great start. That went off about as badly as possible. <laughs> but yeah, about my words about eating peanuts. Yeah, sorry, what about this paper peanuts? You peanuts? cannot eat peanuts fast at all. <laughs> it's true. You, if you try to eat them kind of quickly, they sort of become like peanut butter. Have you, am and I the only like one butter. in the world who tries to make peanut butter in their mouth whenever I eat peanuts? Uh, I would doubt you'd be the only person in the world. Have you ever done that? Um, I think once or twice. I haven't, like, tried to do it, but there was one time I was eating You're like, some how peanuts. long can I eat this? One time I was eating peanuts, and I was like, holy crap, it tastes like peanut butter! So you've at least done it once. Mm-hmm. So, yeah, I bet everybody has probably at uh, least once. Ah. Uh, Even if it is just, you know, I might take a couple tries. I should have practiced time. against this boss here some. Single time that you ever try it is, like... You're at six, but you still tried it. I did not practice against the boss here. I got... Ah, crap. <laughs> Talking about peanut butter, man. I know, but... 
I got through all the stinking level. Ah, oh, come on. None of them were even close to me. Well, in your defense, I mean, the last, like, episode was, like, pretty much all this, I believe. Uh, that was actually earlier this episode. Oh, you're attacking it on the end of it? Yeah, man. That one was long and... Oh, hey, wait. No, it's short. Okay. You're good. We did the math before. Oh, I you didn't. don't remember, because, again, like... I didn't do the math. You did the math. Yeah, well... <laughs> Screw fine. you and your fast so math. I did the math. Ah, I forgot about that. Because you, you did do it, and then we had the cutscene, because you wanted to include that, right? Yeah. Okay. So, so yeah, we, we beat the game, uh, and then we're like, oh, this episode would be short. And then we're like, oh, you know what? We could just tack the, uh, this, 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 the full ending on the end of this episode. Uh, Ark does not recall this, because... I do a lot of the back end of our channel stuff. Oh, crap. I just play and get angry. Yeah. <laughs> um. But yeah, I guess I didn't really realize it. Because, um, like, I forgot about the cutscene and how short that episode was. Mm -hmm. But now you really have to splice in all those, all those cuts about you getting the <laughs> shards. Because we were talking about it, and you're like, well, it may maybe be... if I want to, or if yeah. I remember... No, it's basically going to be a question of how lazy I am because I did I did record me getting all the shards. But um, not but yeah, now you have to because we're calling you out on it. Oh man. And I'm referencing it in this episode. <laughs> how dare you? So now you're pretty much required. <laughs> so I to do even it. remember that thing you just watched where I got all the shards. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Otherwise, they won't know what we're talking about. It's true. <laughs> Forcefulness. <laughs> I really need to I figure out a better way to dodge these. And also not jump into things. What else kind of things did you think as a kid that you look back now and you're like, God, that was nonsense? Um. For one, the peanut butter in the mouth, mouth thing. I don't know, man. I'll write this one. I hate this one. Um. I think I remember one of mine, though. God. I'm gonna die. Um. It was. See how many lives I have, though. Huh? Oh, <laughs> wow! <laughs> Look, man. I, I was, didn't even notice. When I was going through the levels, I was doing pretty good. This game's a lot easier when you're not trying to talk over it. <laughs> so, do you want me to do all the talking? Um. Because I, I mean, just, I, I, I still would just start. Converse. I mean, I just started a story about what I thought of as a kid. Yeah, yeah, that was go stupid. for it. Go for it. I still want to hear it. Okay. Um. Right now it is fall. Mm hmm. And every time it's fall, I remember what I thought of as a kid when it turned to fall. What was that? What do you think of when you think autumn weather? Uh... Probably mostly rain. Exactly, right? Like, <laughs> that's, especially here in Washington, man. That's my whole point. That's the entire thing, because that's exactly what I thought. I thought lots of rain. Uh-huh. And I learned basics about a plant, you know, when you're, like, in first or second grade. They eat from the sun, and... Uh, oh! oh! You were doing so good! Sorry, uh, was I distracting you? No, no, it's fine. It's okay. So I learned basics, right? Photosynthesis, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, soak up water, make oxygen, that kind of bullshit. <laughs> um, <laughs> that's all you really need to know, right? Um, but also, remember what I said? Plants eat water, basically. Yep. That's how they survive. And it rains a lot here in the autumn. A lot. Like, more than usual. Mm -hmm. Any other time of the year. And I know that plants eat water. Yeah. That's a fact. They certainly drink it. Yes. Well, that's that's how... Yeah. <laughs> that's how they stay healthy. But, um... I also know it rains way too much in the autumn. So I always thought... Well, not always. At one point, as a kid, when I was really, really young, I thought because it rains so much, the plants drink too much water, and their leaves get heavy and fall to the <laughs> ground. And then they slowly wither because all their leaves are gone. But then in the next year, like after winter, they slowly gain up their strength that they've been building up and laying in dormant. And they try so hard again in summer, but they can't help themselves and fall into the same rhythm over and over again every year. Mm -hmm. That's something that I thought of as a kid. That's why I thought leaves fell to the ground. Neat. Was this, uh, when you started that story, it reminded me of... Uh, I mean, sort of on the same topic, you know. Thought, thoughts from when I was a kid. Um, Keep going. Like, 
I learned this. I, it, it's from Harvest Moon. I know it's Harvest Moon's fault, but I always thought like Harvest Moon's a good game. The last three months of the year, uh, I always thought those were like uh, winter, and then the first three months were spring. But it turns out December is basically right in the middle of winter. I feel the exact same way. <laughs> I'm almost certain it's Harvest I'm not, Moon that tricked I'm me. I'm actually surprised. I'm not the only one that thinks this. I always thought I was, like, weird because I thought of it like that. But I believe, yeah, it should be separated by the year instead of, like, half the year. Summer should be first. No, spring should be first. Summer, autumn, fall. Right? Sure. So, yeah, that's how it should be. Oh, come on. How the year goes. Like, ah. spring starts at, in January. Uh -huh. And then just follows that it's same pattern. It's very easy to remember if it's like right? that, right? I always have to double check myself. I'm like, it's January. It's almost the beginning of the... Oh, yeah, it's still winter. Yep. <laughs> and it's like, it's trying to catch up. Like, that was how it was supposed to be. But it got, like, people made cutsies and people were buddies and said, yeah, you can cut in front of me. And that's what happens every single year. Mm -hmm. With the seasons. I'm trying to remember, because I think there was one other thing that, like, sort of met your uh, qualifications that I thought of there. Something else I thought when I was a kid. Yes. I cannot remember what it was, though. Was it about, uh, Beetleborgs? Probably not. <laughs> so we're talking about things we, we mistakenly thought from when we were kids. Yeah, well, you also, by the way, I totally got this. And I'm, wa I'm writing on the Beetleborgs movie. <laughs> He's using this as a writing surface for anyone who's curious what he's thinking. And I know we've done about. it. Like, Woo! talked about stuff like that. There now, we, we go. We brought up Beetleborgs before, I believe. Yep. Yeah, no, on one of our previous series, we definitely talked about Beetleborgs a little bit. I still want to watch that again because I'm sure it's terrible. <laughs> I am so certain that that does not hold up. I mean, I showed up once and you were watching it, and I was seven or something, and I'm like, this is terrible. <laughs> And you're like, no, man, it's cool. Well, I mean, I it, I, it came right oh, off. Oh, it's shooting the queen. That's different. Oh, she passed out. There was darkness inside of her all along. And we chased it away. But did we? <laughs> oh, <laughs> Got I thought, a cell phone. I thought he was going to suck it up. Ether Kirby's, come to me. What? Is that what's going on here? No, it's no, just, just, it's just his ride. Star. Everyone almost left without him. They, they carjack in Kirby. <laughs> Grand Theft Star. <laughs> Wait, is there an... Oh, yeah, second part. Yep. Oh, I didn't remember there was a level. I didn't either. I certainly hope I have the skills <laughs> to get through this. It's like the, uh... The boss battles of Mario 64 with Bowser. Mm -hmm. I'm like, oh, yeah, this is the final boss. Boss. In the final bass? <laughs> what, are you going fishing? Oh, yeah, this is final boss, so, uh, I forgot there's a level here. <laughs> yep. I'm sure it's fine. <laughs> final bass. <laughs> Everybody's helping you now. Yep. Oh, this is it. Oh, yeah, this is it. Yeah, this is the final boss I remember. Oh, yeah, you're gonna, like, be all UFO-y yep. and Star Fox 64-y. Sort of, yeah. I don't remember this guy being particularly hard. I think, for the most part, you just gotta keep shooting. It is very Star Fox 64-y. And, uh... Dodge's thing. I also remember thinking, like, Oh, man, how come you can't find these powers in the other parts of the game? <laughs> <laughs> like, you can see down there in the uh, power section, I've got two unique and special things. Yeah, you never found those ones in the game. Alright, here comes... Here comes what is that? Oh, Diamond? There it is. There it is, the weak spot. Oh, the little band-aid! Now That's he's flailing. Mean. Oh, he's got his little cactus thing. I always thought this was gross and weird. He's got like this weird like a fart, cl fart cloud cactus thing coming out of his... Oh, he's got a cactus out of his butt. Yeah, it's like, oh, God. Is that what spawning the cactus spike powers? Uh, I have no idea. I don't either. It's But it's it's gross. Whoa. Looks like a disembodied head. Oh, he's an angel now. Yeah. Neon Genesis Evangelion. Well, this guy's really creepy looking, too. Like, after going through the whole game, you're like you're like, hey, I got all the crystal shards. Everything is and so cute. And then suddenly you fight this guy, and he's like freaking spiky cactus, halo, freaking angel monstrosity. He's like, everything is a lie. Nothing is cute. I created you all. <laughs> also, the music's very dramatic. It is. Well, that's another thing that'd be kind of fun to talk oh, about. Oh, so mean to hit his band-aid. Uh, yep. 
I think it's it's fun to talk about for us. I don't know if anyone cares. Oh, we still got like, any, anyone who may be watching. But uh, I'm pretty happy with our audio quality these days. Yeah. Like I got another uh, cactus dick. We always wanted to uh, make sure that we got as much as we could out of the game audio, without like. But we're dialing it in. Yeah. Cutting over ourselves. That was always the problem early on. We're learning. Yep. That's how we progress, right? But yeah, I was I was editing uh, this and Killer Seven, our current series right now. Uh, and I was like, hey man, you can hear all the cool music. Which is great, because this game actually had really cool music. And all the effects of, like, people whispering you backwards in Animal Crossing sound like they're trying to summon a demon. <laughs> it, it's, it's, it's... Exactly. <laughs> it's always a bit of a shame when, like, there's something cool going on sound-wise. And we talk about it. Yeah. But you can't hear it. <laughs> uh-huh. Alright, so there goes both his wings. It wasn't green. You couldn't shoot it. Well, I was hoping. Doesn't hurt to try. Dude, this really does look like something from Neon Genesis. I honestly haven't watched enough Neon Genesis to... to really? Know. Uh, I caught a couple episodes when it was on late night TV. I hated it, but I loved it. But I never really watched it, because it didn't make a lot of sense. I didn't like any of the characters. And... I hated it, but I loved it. <laughs> like, every episode I, wa I watch, I'm like, I hate this! And yet I tell everybody, Dude, you haven't seen Neon Genesis? <laughs> <laughs> Apparently. I didn't actually know you'd watched it. I do. I actually I think I have it. Huh. One, it was by the studio that did, um... Uh... Shit. <laughs> we were just... It was on your Sonic movie. Nadia. Nadia. Secret of Blue Water. Mm -hmm. They did that one, and yeah. I liked that one. You showed me, like, the first ten episodes or something of Nadia, but then we never stopped. Kept watching it. I liked... Well, oh, that's where <laughs> it gets really good, though. <laughs> Did we really stop then? Yeah, I think so. I think we'll have to watch that sometime. Maybe. It's been a while since we actually had time to watch stuff, because usually, like, during the week we're busy, and then, like, uh, during the weekend we're doing Operation Pixel. Yeah. But yeah, it might be fun to watch stuff sometime. Um, but yeah, we should get back into, like, cool points and all that stuff. <laughs> also, I just beat it. I noticed! I was trying to be nonchalant, but yeah. congratulations. <laughs> like I said, I, I was... That boss was not particularly hard. Like, at least if you know to shoot him in the cactus. It was cool. And the halo. It's very dramatic, but, uh... Not hard. It's not not as complicated as <clears throat> a lot of the other fights in this game have been. You gonna get medals? <laughs> just like Star Wars? Yep, just like Star Wars. Just like Star Wars. Waddle Dee doesn't Waddle Dee gets screwed. <laughs> oh! Oh, so adorable. And then he gasped. He's like, oh! And he sucks on the whole planet. <laughs> <laughs> so there we go. The true ending of Kirby 64. It still took a while, though. It, yeah, it took a little longer than That's I thought. That's okay. I didn't realize it was going to take me like two or three tries to beat the uh, See you next time. boss guy. And then, you know, uh, a little small level and then, and then the final boss guy.